The outcome of the February 25, 2023 presidential and national assembly elections as announced by the electoral body. INEC is sacrosanct or simply put immune from criticism. So says the Board of Trustees of the Association of Local Governments of Nigeria, Algon. It has therefore condemned in strongest terms the alleged plot by some groups of those it described as loose cannons and desperate politicians to instigate, mobilize and promote the interim national government in Nigeria. The BOT, which represents the thoughts of the over 774 local government council areas in Nigeria, said it was greatly displeased with such an unfortunate plan, adding that what is important now is moving forward after the hardship and economic impact experienced before, during and after the elections. According to the statement issued by the chairman BOT Algon, Chief Odunayo Atekbero, and made available to Clearview News Dex, those contemplating interim national government should forget it, as it is completely alien to the Constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, 1999 has amended. According to the BOT, the president elects remains Asiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinibu. In its estimate, Algon Board of Trustees is saying it loud and clear. That Nigeria has had a successful election, even as it has acknowledged that there are some obvious infractions which should be left for the courts to adjudicate. The election tribunal offers a legitimate opportunity for losers to contest their claim. The board, made up of eminent Nigerians, urged Nigerians to be law abiding and steadfast in nurturing our nascent democracy despite all unguarded utterances with inflamed emotions. The board of trustees of Algon is noted for its highly respected views on national interest, including the votes of confidence passed on Algon's president, David Kolade Alabi.